The man to watch. Up against his former club, will he make an impact live on EA TV? Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary box and I'm joined for commentary by Lee Dixon. And looking forward to bringing you action from the second leg of this semi-final. It's Maritimo up against Sporting. Well, thanks, Derek. They've got the advantage today after that away win. What do they do? Do they sit back? I'm sure the home fans will make sure that they push forward and try and get another win. Well, plenty of talk about him from the pundits coming into today's match up against his old club, and that is never easy for a footballer, a mixture of emotions, Lee. Well, Derek, it could be a hugely emotional day, that's for sure. Seeing old friends, teammates, wives, families, etc. But all that has to be acknowledged and then forgotten about instantly. Get on with the game in hand, do your job, perform for your team. And the lineup for the home side. We're thinking 4 3 3. Yeah, one central striker, Derek. The width comes from the wingers who will stay high and wide. A very narrow midfield and a conventional back four. Here's the lineup for Sporting. How would you sum up this formation, Lee? Well, 5 2 3, 3 4 3, lots of numbers. But the most important thing is the fullbacks. They need to supply support to their centre backs in defensive mode. But going forward, they have to supply some sort of support to the wide players who will try and provide the service for the lone striker. Oh, they've lost it. Well, he has players waiting at the back post just unable to take advantage of that developing situation and scope for them to produce something exciting high pressing at its best now the pass not finding its target as clean as a whistle that challenge Good pressure to win the ball back. Paulinho. And you can sense the threat is there. And providing width. Well, that is how to play advantage. Useful looking position, you've got to say. He got in the way of that cross. It's wholehearted defending and the concession of a corner here. And firing it into the area. Not to be this time. Andre Almeida. Beautifully weighted ball. Will he find the net? And in the back of the net. A two-goal cushion now in this tie. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They've been bossing this game up to now. Just to check on the aggregate score, it is 2-0. Oh, 
Oh, he's given the ball away. Good use of advantage by the referee. Excellent block. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Carvalho. Paulinho. And sporting in a position of potential menace. Targets available. Cross comes in. Oh, big opportunity. Oh, it was a crucial challenge. And space to attack. Can he finish this? And a goal! Well, here's the replay. That pullback cross is so hard to defend against. And it all leads to a 2v1 on the keeper, which he really doesn't have any chance with. It's a great team goal. Well, there's nothing better for a manager when a plan comes together. Total satisfaction. Pretty convincing looking aggregate score of 3-0. Bruno Tabata. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. And delivered into the box. Well, mopping up defensively. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Throw-ins given. And he takes on the shot. Good defending to prevent the chance. Bernardo. Carvalho. Oh, not great defending. And it's come off the keeper. And a penalty awarded, spot kick coming up. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. They will now make use of the substitute's bench. Target. 
Well, here it is again. You have to say you should score from a penalty, but I've missed a few in my time. It's a nervy, nervy moment for the taker and nothing to lose for the goalkeeper. It's turned into a runaway on aggregate, 4-0. Enrique. And he read it well, intercepting it. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Opportunity here. Well, body in the way. Still could be dangerous. Another time for cool heads. Bruno Tabata. And now Paulinho. Possession one. This might be ideal for the counter. All in all, a broken... counter-attack and fed forwards real need to get rid of it the pressure was high and they could be in here a goal here giving his team precisely what they were looking for now he deserves to celebrate it And on aggregate here, 4-1 is how it stands. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Well, following that tackle, he's got to go into the book. Yeah, he's mistimed more than anything there, just mistimed his tackle. kick from long range he didn't miss by much Lee no I thought the ball would be coming into the box but long range free kick he's had a go inside the last quarter of an hour now well, they no longer have the ball that's a good looking ball Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Untidy on the ball. Paulinho. Well, you've got to savour such moments. Looks promising, this. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. And the free kick delivery, so very close. Well, he'll think it's in. From that angle, it's just wide.
Well, here's the replay, and what a ball that is to put him through. And how strong was he here? Incredible to hold up the defenders and get his shot away. Lovely goal. So just to confirm the aggregate scoreline of this tie, 5-1 it is. Well, three minutes of stoppage time added on here. Pedro Gonzalves. And the referee's whistle. The home fans are thrilled because they can now book their tickets for the final. Well, because of what's at stake, i.e. a final, semi-finals can be a bit nervy at times. Not the case this time. The semi-final was a breeze. An easy march to that big game. Can't wait for the final, to be honest with you. Let's wait and see whether they can produce what they did in the semis. Oh, they've lost it. Beautifully weighted ball. Will he find the net? And in the back of the net, a two-goal cushion now in this tie. And space to attack. Can he finish this? 